Blueprint, new edition in the house. Ralph, when you listen to some of uh, new editions early or any of the past recordings, which song makes you happiest? You mean early, early? or a lot? At all, out of all of them. I mean, there's so many. I like the Heartbreak <laughs> album a lot. I like Can You Stand the Rain. Mm -hmm. I like the If It Isn't Love. I like the Boys. I like that album. That album to me just seems like it was the album that we were waiting to make ourselves or hear mm -hmm. ourselves make. Mm -hmm. And before then, it was like everybody's interpretation of what we should sound like, the type of records that they thought would work and sell records. Right. And when we got with Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis down in Minneapolis and recorded the Heartbreak album, that was the first time I really was able to sit around and play my album t in the car with my boys, you know, right. driving around and, and really appreciate what we was doing. You, you get introduced and put down with the group. What, did, what, what extra flavor did Johnny Gill bring to New Edition? Um, I think uh, just more of a, um, a, 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 I think more of a much more uh, mature sound. Mm -hmm. I would say this in a way like, New Edition was maturing, right. but I was at that point so ahead of my time, I think mm -hmm. at 15, uh, 14, 15 years old, they didn't know what to do with me when I was, you know, right. uh, when I released the first couple of albums. They was, people were saying, wow, he's got such a mature voice. Right. And How do you market him? Yeah, how do you right. market this kid? So, right. you know, when they was coming up with the, um, the idea of wanting to start to make that transition because, you know, the audience is growing and they wanted to start taking, going into that, that, that direction, sometimes it takes a, it's a process that it, you have to go through in order to get accepted and to right. be able to, to, you know, legitimately be a, right. a, a, a grown, you know, to be mature and be that, the, the, the ladies man. Who, <laughs> Watch out now. <laughs> you know, <laughs> but uh, it happened. Um, I think that's what I helped to bring to the table with uh, New Edition when I joined the group. Johnny Gill, y'all. These are the things that change boys to me. Growing up can be a pain. Not a man until you come my way. We're giving up our teenage years in an effort to pursue our career. Some Christmas of you I'm having to support our family Who's protecting us from all It's up to us to figure out What life is all about So we search for answers to our questions Looking for the answers
You see, what we want to tell y'all tonight is uh, after 19 years, uh, through the ups and downs, through the turnarounds, oh yeah. <laughs> you see, we've come to go. We know, 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 we know. We know that we have to go through ups and downs, turn around. But you're not a man. Said you're not a man. Said you're not a man. Said you're not a man. So all you got to do, all you got to do is. The $80 million question. Um, <laughs> did Bobby leave the group? <laughs> or was Bobby forced out of the group? Mike? He fell asleep and he ran. <laughs> was late for I think, one um, day. <laughs> I think, um, you know, and I'm going to be as truthful as, as the blueprint supposed to be. I think um, Bob was fighting his way to be what he wanted to be, you know. New addition is like structure. Y'all know we wear, we was wearing the suits at 14 and 15, and the way our routines go, songs begin, songs end, and um, you know Ralph was doing the majority of the lead. But if you notice on the first album, he had his own song, Jealous Girl, because you had to give that to him. And I think over the course of time, and you know Bob being the kind of person that you know, even though the girls are screaming for everybody, Bob, you know he feels like they're screaming for everybody, but they really feeling me. <laughs> so, you know, I'm going to take my coat off and I'm going to do exactly. more. And it just, New Edition at that time wasn't allowing him to do more. And, you know, even as friends, because, you know, Bobby was my best friend when we was younger. Ralph and Ricky was best friends and me and Bob was best friends. And we used to talk about it. And I try to tell him, you know, your time will come. <clears throat> well, you know, you will be able to sing like Ralph and y'all could do y'all's thing together. And uh, when we started not thinking together is when it all went down. <laughs> 